Having fresh, clean, and healthy air is key to healthy living. This is ever more important as we insulate our houses to tighter and tighter standards for energy savings. To solve this problem here at the Greenwich House, I installed an ERV, or Energy Recovery Ventilation System from Zender America. John Rockwell is with me today again to show us some of the components. Hi, John. Thanks for all your support throughout the entire installation process. Hi, Sabine. It's nice to see you and to be here now that the system's fully installed. Yes, and tell us a little bit more of the detailed components here. Sure. Well, as you mentioned earlier, houses have become more and more airtight as a result of energy codes. Mm -hmm. When houses become more airtight, they save a lot of energy, but it's hard to breathe. So yes. you need to bring in some fresh air. And a way to do that is instead of using old exhaust fans that we used to use when we grew up, exhaust air from the bathrooms and kitchens, run it through a heat exchanger, and warm the incoming fresh air from the outside. That's mm -hmm. the essence of an air-to-air -air heat exchanger. In wintertime, it saves a lot of heat energy by giving a lot of that heat to the incoming cold air stream. In the summertime, it cools the incoming air by that heat being given to the outgoing airstream. So it's always a heat transfer process, and it always works, and it's the simple marvel of physics, really. So that is all about energy efficiencies, too. Absolutely. Up to 90% of the temperature difference can be recovered, and about two-thirds of the humidity, which is great in a climate like Greenwich, being near the ocean, being somewhat mm -hmm. warm in the summertime, you can lower your air conditioning needs and your dehumidification requirements by having an ERV. That's really big. Very big. So as I follow these shiny insulated lines right over here, it takes me to some distribution boxes. So the airstream is divided into these silencers, then sent through these manifolds and these tubes through the rooms where CO2 levels increase, typically bedrooms at night with doors closed. Mm -hmm. So to enhance sleep, we often supply fresh air to bedrooms so that people get a better night's sleep. This was the most time consumptive element of the entire installation right here. It's beautiful now, the way it is all nicely labeled. We have red and we have blue. These tubes are designed two tubes to bathrooms, two tubes to bedrooms. Depending on whether it's supply or return, the returns are in red, the supplies are in blue. How do fans affect the system? You know that the building inspector had us install a special makeup air system for the kitchen hood, for example. That's right. A makeup air system uh, prevents depressurization when you run an exhaust fan like mm -hmm. a kitchen hood. Our system is designed to have the same amount of air coming in and going out. It's perfectly balanced and neither pressurizes nor depressurizes the building. Is there any need for your technicians to come back on a regular basis or not? Other than the commissioning, which is an important part of installation and design, where we make sure the fans are perfectly balanced, the only maintenance that you need is checking the filters periodically. It really depends on the environment outside the building about how frequently you check them. You can vacuum them clean. You can order new ones if they're too dirty from ZenderAmerica.com. Beautiful. Great. I love how super light and well-designed these Zender components are. I'm so happy that we could have a Zender ERV here at the Greenwich House. In my view, an ERV is a really critical element to having a healthy indoor environment and air quality.